The point of doing the count in the first place is to sort of have that sort of, we sort of look at it as a generational leap from sort of anecdotal stuff based on like shelters are full, uh, people are sleeping in the park, like all this kind of information that's all very true but all very relative and sort of requires uh, some nuance and some understanding of the issue. What we're hoping to get out of this is an actual hard number that will actually be readily apparent and very easily dig digestible to sort of show the actual size of the homeless population in the city of Regina. To every bit of data that we grab during this uh, helps for, for different points in, in policy making. I've worked for 50 of my 60 years. Canada is screwed. We cannot afford the situation we're in now. They're paying $919 a month for me to stay here. Plus, they're giving me $145 a month as my personal allowance. So what, $1,100? There's, uh, let's see, I figure 150, 160 people in here usually. Do the math. Just this one building and how many other people here? And we can't afford it. It was good. It was um, fairly slow out there. We were expecting to see a few more people out and about, but it was great and the turnout was awesome. And having uh, such a diverse group of people going through the neighborhood was great. We learned from each other and had chats about uh, homelessness and where everybody works and volunteers and it, it was really good. A great experience altogether. It was all in all positive uh, when you're out there and it's the first time we've done something like this in Regina so you're not really sure what to expect but it was good. It was a good experience and I think everyone learned a little something tonight. The numbers are what they're, they're going to be. Um, we're not going to count every homeless person in Regina tonight. We never were. Uh, so the fact that we have every shelter on board and delivering the survey, the fact that we have 100 plus volunteers out uh, taking time out midweek uh, between 10 and midnight to deliver a survey on what is not the nicest night in the world is a huge measure of success. This has been an awesome engagement thing and it's sort of really a great first step in sort of acquiring that baseline data.